morning dear students let us take a look at a question from je advanced 2020 this question is from the wave optics chapter let us first analyze the question a parallel beam of light strikes a piece of transparent glass having cross section as shown so this is a parallel beam of light that we have here and let us have a look at the glass so this is a glass here and it has a cross section like alphabet b sort of so this parallel beam of light strikes the glass and the correct shape this is a question he is asking the correct shape of the emergent wave front will be so he had given us four options and uh, in those four options he had given the shape of the wave front and we need to choose the correct option so let us first draw the emergent wave front and then i'll put the options here and uh, we can have a look at the options so firstly all these points here are in the same phase so here we have planar wave fronts okay he has not mentioned that this is vacuum so we will just take that this is vacuum and the speed of light is c so from here to here light will travel with speed c now the wave front which was here the planar wave front which was here has traveled here with speed c and now the wave front is here now as light enters the glass its speed decreases to c divided by 1.5 okay so you would have noticed that the speed of light has decreased here and still all these points here are in same phase and still the wave front is planar wave front now some part of light moves from glass to vacuum and the speed again increases to c so this part of light has gone outside the glass so it has traveled even more distance than all these points here so now the wave front will look like this c all these points are in same phase right so wave front will be something like this and here so inside it will be planar and outside there will be a bulge and again planar now the rays which are here travel further than these because they have come out of glass so now all these points here are in the same phase so we will have here a plane wave front followed by a bulge here and again here plane see his question is correct shape of emergent wave front now the light has not fully emerged from the glass now the light rays have fully emerged from the glass and all these points here are in the same phase so let us join all these points here to get the emergent wave front so this here is our emergent wave front these were the four options which are given and out of these four options option a most resembles this one he has mentioned that uh, the figures are schematic and not drawn to scale so the most suitable option is option a one more question i have for you all here see in the exam if he would have said draw the possible wave fronts after the light strikes the plane surface of the glass okay draw all the possible wave fronts after the light strikes the surface of the glass so let us again visualize the path that the light rays take see till here we had only planar wave fronts so planar wave front is not given in the option okay so here we have a plane then a bulge and again a plane so the possible wave front after this light enters this uh, plane surface c could be option c okay if that was the question what are the possible wave fronts after it enters this uh, glass surface then it would be option a and option c for the question given in the exam the correct option is option a so see you all here and meet you in the next video